Hey, what's going on, guys? Mark here, aka Planet Crash Bash, back on Mad 15 Ultimate Team. And you know what? Look, after that whole bonanza of the 4th of July Master Set, I thought, you know what? Now's the perfect time to do a large quick sell pack. Because I only needed four silver badges, actually, and I've been accumulating that over time. So I said, you know what? Screw it. Might as well get to do this. Maybe we can make some coins back. I mean, that wasn't the best Lombardi pack bundle ever. So I thought maybe our whole, all our hopes could be cured with this large quick sell. So hopefully EA, please be freaking gentle on this one, please. This is going to be a really quick video, by the way, guys. So once I do this, it's pretty much going to be it. Thought I might as well do it. Here we go. Large quick sell in three, two, one. Let's get it. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? Oh, okay, okay. I like it. 50K. 50K. Not bad. Not bad at all. I do not mind 50K coins. Guys, if you like the video, go and hit that like button. If you want to see more content to support the channel, go and hit that subscribe button. I'm Mark, AK Point of Crash Bash. I will see you guys in the next video. Take it easy, y'all. Peace. Okay, guys, I thought, you know, that little pack opening or large quick sell was just a little bit too short for you guys just to put that video out on its own. So I might as well, I just thought, you know, let me just run into Gauntlet real quick. One of my favorite game modes from this year's Mutt. And just throw a quick game of Gauntlet in there. Why not see how far we can get? But real quick, I want to talk about these the situation with the fire. Yeah, <laughs> the situation with the fireworks, uh, with a lot of these players getting hurt. As you know, uh, Jason Pierre Paul. It was actually reported today. You know, damn, recording this that he had it. One of his legs got it. Uh, not. I'm dumb. His, one, his index finger got amputated. I know Adam Schefter tweeted out a picture of the uh, medical, I think it was like the medical record or his chart, which, uh, by the way, uh, Dr. Patient Confidentiality, Adam Schefter, you ever heard of it? But just saying, like, going off of what we've seen in uh, CJ Wilson, you know, he's gotten injured. It's like people are saying don't have the players, you know, should be fixed into their contracts. They can't mess with fireworks or, you know, just hire somebody else to do it first off guys here's the thing we don't know how the fireworks got messed up you know were they just holding in their hand like yo i could blow you know i could just light this firework up off my hand and it's gonna go boom i don't know but like here's the thing accidents are gonna happen maybe it was an accident maybe it was just like a freak you know thing that happened the wire messed up or it backfired you know it was a dud round he maybe they went to go fix it and it just shot up because that's happened I'll, I'll be honest like when we've done fireworks before the july now my family we've had fireworks before where they won't shoot off and we're like oh okay so it's a dud walk one step next you know it goes off and it's like that could have happened to jpp or cj wilson again i don't know what happened and if you guys know what happened, hey, fill me in the comment section. I don't know. <laughs> but me personally, it's like, look, accents are going to happen. Should it be fixed into their contracts? I don't know. You really can't do that because, well, I, well actually, they probably could. But me personally, I don't think they should. Because, again, accents are going to happen. It was just a freak thing that went down. It's going to Look, a guy can go driving to the store and just his car can get T-boned or just go off a cliff off something random and anything can happen what are they going to write in their contracts you can't drive you have to get a personal show for spend your money and do all that no i mean let no you can't it don't make any sense same thing you can apply that situation to anything he goes bike riding car goes off a cliff <laughs> no he goes bike riding and a, his bike gets hit by a car <laughs> okay so like you can really apply that to anything you just gotta I, I don't know how to say it. It, it. It's just like accents happen, you know, stuff goes down. You can't really fix it. So, but that, you know, that's that. That's my whole take on the whole fireworks situation with JPP and uh, CJ Wilson. I hope JP, you know, if Jason Pierre Paul, if he could play this season, that'd be great, man. It's sad to see, you know, when a player goes down with an injury like this, and even if their career ends. Same with CJ Wilson, man. He lost two fing fingers, allegedly. He got two fingers amputated. Bro, he got three fingers on one hand, a cornerback. So he got... <sighs> Yo, man. His career, more than likely, is donezo. I mean, unless he could find a way to play with three fingers at cornerback, like, the dude would have the utmost respect <laughs> with me. He would have my respect, 100%. But, 
well, not saying he doesn't, but you know what I mean. <laughs> the dude is just like, and I know people are saying, like, he would have a hard time making the roster anyway. Probably would have gotten cut. I don't care about that. Like, seriously, it sucks to see an NFL player's, like, dreams just get shattered because of a freak accident that happened celebrating the 4th of July. It's stupid. I just hate that. I hate seeing that. But, you know, hope they get better, man. And just all that. We're pretty much getting screwed over on the gauntlet right now. We have one life left. We got to throw her here to Greg Olson. All right. But like I said, that's my take on the whole fireworks situation. Hope those two get better. Hope their careers can still go on. They find a way, you know. All right, there we go. Let's hand that off to D'Angelo. Let's get back to this gauntlet thing. So, okay, we're at 17 points right now. We got one life remaining. We screw up. It's done. We're done. Okay, we're going to make a goal line stand right here. What do we have to do? Stop a touchdown. Okay. Let's see if we can... uh. See if we can get to the quarterback real quick. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. It's Eli Manning. He goes down. He can't get out of the pocket. He, Eli, stay in the pocket. Throw passes. And if you haven't noticed, by the way, just real quick, if you haven't noticed the thumbnails, I have been working on it. Shout out to Vic for helping me out. And shout out to Shout Town, man. Both for helping me out getting these thumbnails going. <laughs> I've been meaning to do this for a long time. Finally got Photoshop working on my computer. I'm very thankful we got that. And here we go. Boom. Got it. Let's go. I've always had trouble on this freaking uh, boss round. And we finally got it. Thank you. Hard pass protection. Choose a pass protection. Left, right, max. Uh, by pressing the LB, then based on how it is. So I would want max protect. Yeah. Got it right. Let's go. But we can't make the pass. Look at that. Incomplete pass. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching the entire video. Hope you guys liked the large quick sell that happened. Hope you guys loved my torture going through those Lombardi packs when I completed the master set. And hope you guys loved this guy on the video. Thank you guys for watching. If you like the video, go and hit that like button. If you want to see more content, help support the channel. If you are ready for Man 16 coming out, you want to see more Man 15 content, all sorts of games and all that crap, go and hit that subscribe button. I'm Mark, AK Planet Crash Bash. Take it easy, y'all. Peace.